Alright guys, we are back for another Dokkan Battle video. So we have got um, LR Tech Broly. Um, our boy is going to be getting his EZA here. Um, I think that Broly should be pretty good. Um, potentially not really my type of character, where I typically like characters who are a lot better defensively, but... I do think that this Broly will be able to do enough damage to where you go, oh, oh, that's a lot of damage. That's a lot of damage. Um, so this should be another one of those super, super, super easy, um, whatchamacallits for people, um, uh, easy events. If we jump over and take a look, it's Bond of Parent and Child. So, so easy to get that done, right? We will not have trouble with that whatsoever. Um, so, you know, we, we just jump over here, um, and then bond of parent and child, you know, remember, we want to use LRs for bond of parent and child, uh, to be able to penetrate Broly's damage reduction, um, and then if we want to actually, you know, have the defense, that's bond of parent and child characters, so, uh, I think that this one should be easy for most players. So, being able to use a lot of characters like this should be pretty easy. Um, we have a large assortment of powerful LRs, so it should be, you know, pretty easy for free-to-play players as well. Um, I mean, I don't really recommend the AGL Blues, but they certainly do have a great leader skill for something like this. I mean, remember, we're fighting Tech Broly here. Um, AGL UI Goku, of course, is still going to be a king for something like this. I think I'll actually, I'm actually going to put him on the team. Um, because even though he has type disadvantage and stuff like that, remember, he does have his guaranteed crits, um, and he will be able to dominate, decimate, and humiliate Tech Broly. Alright, let's jump in like this. Um, unfortunately, the game is like, oh, you want to use the HO Blue Goku and Vegeta, right? It's like, uh, no. <laughs> no, I don't. Uh, LR, Vegeta, and Trunks, with their bond, apparent, and child leader skill, is more than fine enough. Um, okay, this is going to be very, very simple to do. Um, I think every stage we just jump in and we'll win within just a couple of seconds. Um, Beast Gohan, of course, is mega elite for events like this. Evolution Blue Vegeta is going to be crazy. Tech UI will be crazy, right? I mean, we could use some of the best LRs in the game that have guaranteed crits, guaranteed additionals. So it should be pretty easy to just trash um, Tech Broly very fast. Uh, LR EZAs really are just the so much better than TUR EZAs. Um, I, I think that they should... I, I really wish that they would just change the format for regular EZAs to LR EZAs, but to be fair, we've now been talking about this for quite a while, and I mean, I don't know. I, get, I don't want to say that they can't ever do it, um, considering they did uh, get rid of, whatchamacallit, um, Chain Battle. Like, them, like, getting rid of Chain Battle, like, remember, they got rid of the original Battlefield, although I wish they had not done that. Because I think a lot of people would actually be intrigued that that old Battlefield, you know, having returned. But we do have kind of like the replacement Battlefield 2.0. So, you know, maybe they could, you know, do some adjustments and stuff like that. I mean, maybe if the Japanese player base complained enough, we would see it. I don't know. All right, so not really a great opening rotation right here. We got uh, three slot one characters. Always not the best. Now, remember, um, Vegeta and Trunks, as long as they have their intro up, though, I mean, they are guarding. Um, although, against Tech Broly, they would be guarding anyway. Um, I just brought LR Super Saiyan 4 Goku, you know, because he's, he's an int LR. Uh, this is the type of rotation we would need in order to not... Wow, full additional? He does an additional? Okay. This is the type of rotation I think we're going to need to get in order to not finish Broly off um, in one turn, right? Like, we just get the double Vegeta and Trunks. Because Vegeta and Trunks, I mean, damage-wise, hit him with 10 system additional normal. Uh, Damage-wise, they're obviously not up to snuff, you know, compared to, um, you know, some of the more modern LRs, Evolution Blue Vegeta, Beast Gohan, you know, those types of uh, big guns. Wow, actually, they did a little damage to Vegeta and Chunks there, huh? All right, so Broly probably does hit pretty hard, but considering how good the roster is, I, I still don't imagine that this is going to become um, an issue for people, right? So, all right, all right, sure. Yep, we could just go ahead and let them finish off, and that's going to be that. Okay, perfect. Perfect. 
Moving on to the next stage. Uh, still got a few more stages to do. I typically do, like, like I still like to cover all the events, you know, give my thoughts on it and stuff like that. So, like, for the LR Easy events, I'll usually start at stage 5. And then for the Easy ATUR events, I usually start at stage 25. Um, typically what I do with, with these events, right? Alright, so there is, of course, the, uh, LR Broly. Um, let's... Oh, actually, damn, that's kind of unfortunate. Uh, by... Yeah, damn it, dude. That's such a pain in the ass. We got bad... Uh, dude, oh, of course, of course. Every... I feel like every... Every run, it's like, oh, yeah, we got the bad, the bad RNG. With Broly not attacking first... That would lower the damage output by the rotation a lot since Beast, you know, we put Beast in slot one, he gets hit, he would, um, you know, get the extra attack, probably, you know, be able to get up to damn near guaranteed crits, he'd get the guaranteed additional super, and then he'd also give key to the rest of the rotation as well. Remember both Evolution Blue Vegeta and potential some additional normal. Remember both Evolution Blue Vegeta and EJL UI Goku get a huge attack buff at 24 key, and of course their guaranteed crits at 24 key uh also so you know not being able to get to quite to 24 key does lower our damage no additional by ui goku either oh my god well i guess i i i guess it's it's uh things worked out well right i, I <laughs> i'd much rather we get like really like oh my god all the bad rng is coming right now so that way when we're you know like i don't know showcasing tech broly we're getting the additional supers and stuff like that I definitely would prefer that. <laughs> no, no doubt about that. I would prefer that. All right, so let's get that stage done. We're getting missions. We're getting potential orbs, Kai's, all the good stuff. I'm definitely very interested to see how this Broly works. I, I think that the Broly certainly could uh, turn into a very entertaining beast, huh? I guess, I mean, we probably could just rock double beast. What? I guess I guess I'm the only one who's actually still just rocking Vegeta and Trunks, huh? That's what that looks like to me. Looks like I'm the only one who's still just like, all right, Vegeta and Trunks, here we go. No one else is doing that. I'm the only sicko who's still doing that. All right, let's hit this. Uh, key for this rotation will be really good because again we got Beast Gohan and Slot One. We know how this is gonna go. We're gonna get hit a bunch of times, get the extra attack. Uh, my beast does have a, a little bit of dodge, but, well, when I say a little bit of dodge, he's got six dodge. Not exactly that crazy. Um, we already have dodged, actually, several super attacks of my beast, Gohan. Uh, one thing I would emphasize to people is always never go, like, zero dodge on these characters. Uh, that is definitely not uh, a good idea. You, you want to give yourself a chance. Three dodge, I think, for many characters certainly can suffice. I mean... You will win many runs off of that. I, I promise. I'm, you know, ask anyone that, like, the only people who say, it, no, that doesn't happen is the people who have never even done it, right? They say it doesn't happen. But anyone that does it, they go, oh, yeah, yeah, it works like that. Um, but, like, a beast probably is still fine with just, like, with just three dodge. I know a lot of people don't put any on him at all. But, I mean, bosses have already evolved to the point where he can be killed. I mean, the circumstances um, will matter quite a bit. Right, in, in terms of, like, Beast Gohan actually taking damage. But, like, when it comes to Bulma with her basically 6 million super attack and, you know, Goku and Frieza at, with their, like, 5.6 million super attack or whatever it is, you know, we have several bosses that are actually hitting so hard, you know, and, and they're actually both fairly deep into a fight, right? Both of those fights I would consider um, longer fights for sure. Bulma has many phases, and then the Goku and Frieza fight is four phases, but... You have to get through 17 in Golden Frieza, um, who really are a real terror of a boss, for sure. All right, good thing with Beast is he'll get hit, and he'll build that up, so we could just do that. Then we could give UI Goku the rest, and then I'll just hit that, and then just get uh, Vegeta and Trunks what we need right there. Yeah, Beast Gohan is such a great easy LR character. Like, he, he works so good for these types of events. Um, that key support he gives... I love when characters do that, right? I know three off the top of my head that have, like, a similar ability. There's definitely others, but Beast, when he gets hit, gives three key to the rotation. Uh, Orange Piccolo, Power Awakening Piccolo, gives two key to the rotation. Um, and then Videl, EZA Videl, I believe when she dodges, she gives two key to the rotation, right? I believe those are the three characters which um, 
that obviously is pretty solid. Yeah, Beast by himself basically just eradicates Broly. Okay. Not really too surprising there. So probably just like a, a superhero build probably would be better to do than Vegeta and Trunks. Maybe I'll try and get a little bit further in this Broly EZA and I will just rock a superhero build. Maybe I should do that. Why don't I? For stage 10, why don't I just come in with superhero? Let me see what that would look like. So superhero bond of parent and child. What does that look like? I mean, we would probably have like Blue Cow, King Goku, Evolution, Blue Vegeta. Um, I mean, I guess we could just run LR Ultimate Gohan. I mean, he probably would be effective in here for some of these earlier stages. Yeah, sure. Why don't, why don't I just for stage 10? Why don't we take a look at what that will look like? We'll probably beat the stage um, a little bit faster too, doing it that way. Well, yeah, this will probably <laughs> this will probably work well. Having two beasts is certainly much better than two Vegeta and Trunks's. That's for goddamn sure. All right, so now we're at stage ten. Now we get Broly, uh, who's already been a boss in a couple of stages here. Oh, beautiful, perfect rotations. So Broly is probably going to be dead um, immediately right here. Let's. Uh, he, we're going to get three key. Let's just make sure. Let's ensure that he's Vegeta's at uh, twenty-four key. To get the big attack buff as well as the crit. All right, Broly at the super attack right away. Uh, I do. I love fighting like this Broly as a boss because his animations obviously look good. Um, that that's what's so good about like you know all these kind of elaborate animations and LRs and stuff like that. So even when the boss is attacking us, you know it's going to look quite good as they're doing these crazy you know elaborate animation super attacks and stuff like that. All right, the friend Beast Gohan. Hopefully, he throws in a hidden potential system additional super for us. Which he... No, it's a hidden potential system additional normal, like always, of course. Of course, you guys know what it's going to be. What are we at? 10 mil? Damn, if only we had a tournament of power character next to him. Uh, Vegeta's damage would have been uh, quite a bit higher right there, but that's still pretty good. If he could triple super, we could kill here. Oh, normal hidden potential system. We didn't even get it. Ah, damn it. Uh, the dream of one turning this tech Broly gone. Gone with the wind, man. Yep, that's. <laughs> you know, you guys know, that's why. Yep, hit him with 10 system to show normal every time. So I don't go too crazy on those additional builds, guys, you know? You know, I'm just, just saying. There's a reason. Oh. Alright. See ya. He's out of here. Yeah, Blue Cow can Goku and Evolution Blue Vegeta. Their their damage, of course, is always going to be really good. So they would be able to dissect Broly pretty quickly um, with all their additionals, their rainbow orb changing, their guaranteed crits and such and such. So, all right, uh, we're going to have Broly ready to be easy aid here. Um, let's go ahead and uh, go straight into the showcase. Um, and let's see how good easy aid LR Broly is going to be. Um, I do think that this guy is going to be a, a pretty powerful... I think he's going to be popular. I think that this Broly, it is going to be a thing where he's going to be able to die a lot. I do think so. Like, I, I, I do think we're going to probably see this tech Broly potentially die a lot. But I'm worried about his base form is, is what I'm worried about. Um, but he's also going to be dropping, you know, 50 million attack stats, big, huge damage which typically is what people tend to like the most, right? Just monster damage, monster truck damage. So let me know what you guys think. We'll see how good Broly is.